Hi there, my name is Peter Vox and welcome to another Singing Teacher Reacts video proudly brought to you by Vox Singing Academy. If we could help you or someone that you know with their singing, please check out the links below. We have six studios here in beautiful Melbourne, Australia. We also give online singing lessons seven days a week worldwide via Skype or Zoom. But if you don't want to have face-to-face -face singing lessons with one of our beautiful male or female teachers, please check out the Ultimate Online Singing Course, which will stream high-quality singing tuition to you anywhere, anytime, catering for beginners to professionals, courses starting at a mere $19.95 per month. Check out the links below for more info. More importantly, if you like this channel, please click like and subscribe. Keep your comments. If you want me to react to a video, put them in the comments below. I read every comment and that is no word of a lie. We're building a great community here. I love interacting and communicating with everyone from around the world. So please keep your comments um, just even just put a peace symbol or a heart from what country you're from. Uh, it's absolutely fantastic. Thank you so much. But please be respectful and be kind to everyone out there with your comments. If not, go to another channel because you're not welcome on this one. But I'm sure all of our viewers here on this on this React video that have subscribed are polite and nice and respect and love everyone. <clears throat> I've been requested to do this and I'm passionate about this band, ACDC. They're an Australian band. We have a lane here in Melbourne, which is called ACDC Lane. If anyone ever visits Melbourne, please let me know. I'd love, it, love to take you down to ACDC Lane and show you around. So uh, let us know if, you, if you're uh, in Melbourne. Um, get me here. Um, growing up in the 70s, I'm a 70s child, it was a staple diet to basically be, be raised on, I was raised on three bands in Australia. That they were ACDC, Cold Chisel, and Australian Crawl. They're the three bands that I was a real sta staple diet of. But particularly ACDC. If you weren't into ACDC or Australian Rules Football growing up, you were an outcast basically. <laughs> Everyone knows of ACDC. Um, I followed them and I was, I was a big fan of ACDC from their 70s, um, particularly their, their Highway to Hell album, which is my first uh, ACDC album uh, that I brought when I was 10 years old. And then I basically just worked back uh, through their catalogue and then forward because they released um, <clears throat> Back in Black in, in 1980 and it was a different singer and it was a different thing for me. This is with their, their uh, second singer, Brian Johnson. I've seen ACDC numerous times and I love them. And we also have a band just up the back there, um, Airborne, which are very much in the vein of ACDC that I teach and I taught, uh, taught the whole band actually. And they're a huge band, and especially the European people would have know, know, would know of a, um, Airborne, uh, particularly in Europe. Uh, they're huge over in Europe and here in Australia as well too. So check uh, Airborne out, guys. They're, they're absolutely amazing. If you love ACDC, uh, definitely check Airborne and another band called Massive out as well too. Two, uh, two great Australian rock bands that are really flying the flag for rock here in Australia overseas. Without any further ado... Let's watch the one and only and the mighty and Australia's greatest rock and roll band and export, ACDC, doing Thunderstruck. I'm pumped. Are you pumped? If you're not pumped, stand up and do some jumping jacks. Get into this. <laughs>
good is that? That's what it's about. Man, I'm pumped up after watching that. Imagine being in that crowd there. That's just rock and roll at its absolute best. That's what it's about. It's about energy, going to a live show, putting that on in the car, driving way, way faster than what you should be, getting a speeding ticket and saying to the police officer, sorry I sped, but I was listening to ACDC and I just couldn't help but driving fast. Holy shit, how good is that? I haven't seen this performance blown away. Imagine being in that crowd, Donington, 1991. This is probably ACDC at their absolute peak and strength. Pro Brian Johnson's just absolutely on fire. How good is his voice? It just sounds like he's grinding metal with that voice. Just amazing. Look at, look at the stage. Angus still got the long hair and just, just, just ripping it up. Oh man, I'm pumped up from just watching that. It's invigorating. Man, it would have been so good just to be in the crowd there. Have a look at that. Donington, there must just be... There would have to be 100,000 people in that crowd there. It's just, just absolutely amazing. Wow. I'm blown away. Now look, I've heard that song before numerous times. Um, but what can I say? Whew. I'm blown away. I had to catch my breath. I'm, I'm sitting down, but I'm, I'm, I'm rocking in my seat here. And that's just rock and roll at its best. And that's what Australia is being born and bred on, on that. And we've grown up with this type of music. And I've grown up with this. This is something that I heard. I heard ACDC when I was started primary school. And just something that we've always known. And, and it's just staple diet here. And just, it's, it was every day on the radio. It was played. And it's just about energy and it just gets you up and going and it's just about having a good time and it's about fun and it just, it just, it just invigorates me and it keeps me alive and it's the reason why I do this. Um, do these React videos, singing teacher, uh, sing. This is what it's friggin' about is, is this, the live performance, the enjoyment of having that much enjoyment for that many people was just amazing. I'm blown away. Let's get into Jono's voice. Brian Johnson uh, joined the band in 1980 after the tragic death of Bon Scott, unfortunately, through mishap. Um, and they're both fantastic singers, two different singers. Um, bon had a, a lot cleaner voice, more nasalier voice. But Brian definitely had, had a very high range and they pushed him quite high. He was in a band called... Um, I'm just trying to remember the band. It was called um, Geordie was the name of the band that he was in before he joined ACDC. And um, didn't sing as high, but ACDC could hear that he had that voice and, and that's why they recruited him and, and the rest is history. They, re they released the, I personally think, the best rock album in the history of rock is, is, is Back in Black by ACDC and coming second would be Highway to Hell. If you haven't listened to those albums, there is not a weak note on either one of those two albums. Two of the, two of the most consistent rock albums in the history of, of, of music uh, right there. And you're gonna get the best of both of the two singers right there if you're new to ACDC. I'm trying to catch my breath. Brian Johnson, amazing, just, just comes in. Um, Got the chin down, really giving it to it. Um, the whole band's giving it to it. The whole band's 100%. Angus is just, just going crazy on the guitar there. Uh, Brian's voice, um, you know, apparently doesn't warm up. Apparently just, just comes straight in. Uh, what I've heard here say, comes straight in, just basically goes for it. Amazing voice, so fantastic voice. Would love his mouth to work a little bit more. He constricts the sound. Uh, and he gets through, gets through the shows. I've, I've gone and seen ACDC shows. He gets through two hours, um, you know, no problems at all. So, uh, you know, he's, uh, I know he had some hearing problems last year, but uh, absolutely fantastic. So um, let's keep it going here. I can't say much more. Brian Johnson, um, great singer, um, you know, really got that, yeah! 
I was born so raw. He's got that high up sound in his voice there that that he that he uses and he uses that. And we teach this. This is it's quite an easy technique. I'm sitting down doing this. Quite an easy technique to do. So um, it's a really really good technique that all the rock singers can sing safely with. And we teach this at Vox Singing Academy. Let's keep it going. Let's watch it to the end, and I'll give you my uh, my run run through at the end. If I can stay in my seat, I might have to get up and have a bit of a bit of a boogie. Fantastic. Look, Brian Johnson, you can see his technique there. Microphone technique's great. Going for high notes, he, his technique is great because he pulls his chin down when he's singing up high, so he doesn't raise his head up. It's a big habit that a lot of singers, they raise their head up when they're going for high notes. Um, BJ, other way. Mic really close, coming back down. Really controlled with his breathing all the way through, not doing anything more than what he needs to do, not putting any ad libs in or anything like that, just coming and singing everything straight in exactly like the album was. Absolutely fantastic. His voice was a powerhouse all the way through. Um, I love his mouth to work a little bit more. He's got this bit of a yeah, clenched jaw thing. I like that to work a bit more, but you can see his, his abs are really working. So he's really putting his whole body into it, really getting it so he's supporting, taking it off the chords there. Absolutely fantastic. One of the best rock vocalists that there basically is. Amazing technique. He has got a naturally husky voice when you hear him uh, speak. Uh, so he's got a naturally gritty voice. He also, I think he's given up the smokes now, but he used to smoke. Back then he used to smoke. Um, and yeah, absolutely fantastic. Amazing range, great song, great dynamics through that. Um, and you can hear him doing that. Ah, he was doing some lower things there. You can hear that. Um, through the lower things. So he has a, quite a lower range as well too when he was doing it in the middle of the song. You can hear his voice. You can hear the couple of different voices. You can also hear Malcolm there. Uh, uh, Malcolm, uh, what an amazing uh, rhythm guitarist that, that's gone. But absolutely fantastic. ACDC got their, their new album coming out very shortly and they've had a uh, had two singles released. So check that out as well too. Hope you liked that React video from Home Grown Australia. They're the biggest export that we've had, the, the greatest rock and roll band in the world. Very proud of them to say that they've come from Australia. Uh, come and check out ACDC Lane here when you're in beautiful Melbourne, Australia. If we could help you or someone that you know with the singing, please let us know. We'd be absolutely honoured. We have six studios here in Melbourne, online singing lessons all around the world with beautiful male and female teachers. We also have the ultimate online singing course if you don't want to have face-to-face -face singing lessons 
please click like and subscribe. That's really important. If you have a video you want me to, to react to, put it in the comments. Please, let's keep this lovely community going that we're going. But most importantly, please live with passion. Be good to each other. Until the next React video, much love.